arguably the most famous 19th hole in golf, the Jigger Inn. The building dates back to the 1850s and you can still feel the history and heritage with the golf memorabilia covering the walls. Their traditional Scottish pub sits just behind 17 Green of the Old Course, next to the Old Course Hotel, but it's so much more than just a pub. It becomes the gathering spot to swap stories from the course next to a crackling fire and sip on one of the Scottish beers. You could be sitting next to a local, a family who's traveled from across the world, or one of the top competitors or amateurs of the Dunhill Lynx. I'm going to catch up with Luis and Esther who have been a part of the Jigger Inn for a combined 30 years. Let's go. Every time I walk into the Jigger Inn, it feels like coming home. But what is it for you guys that just makes it feel so special here? Um, well, to me, it's that everybody, that you know everybody, you've got familiar faces, people come in, they treat you like you're one of the family, the way they speak to you, the way they like, you come up and give you hugs. Yeah, because so. they know your name and they treat you like, that, that again, like you're part of their family, so, and to them, they just love coming yeah, year after year. Familiar, yeah, familiarity yeah. Of, of coming in, looking around, everything's still the same, you've got the same pictures, we've had some, you know, the team's been there for quite a while, so you've got the familiarity of that. So everything feels just like going back into your own house. I suppose that's probably why. Yeah. Yes, sir. And over the last 15 years, what's changed? We've got older. <laughs> <laughs> and so some of the people that we've seen over yeah. the years, they've got a little bit older. <laughs> but generally, um, so. nothing much has really no, changed. Not really. You know, we get the same, a lot of the familiar faces that we've been coming back and forth for, you know, for the little past while. They're just people. <laughs> and that's you no know, people come and they're going, Oh, we need to get their autograph, we need to do this and we're like that. No, that at the end of the day, to us because they've been coming so often, they're just people. Just people. And you guys are like the resident bouncers. There's no <laughs> photos, there's no autographs. This is such a safe place to come and just enjoy a pint with your friends. Well that's yeah. what they want. They want to come in. They still want the ambiance and all the, the laugh and the jokes, but you know, they want to come in and have a pint just like everybody else. So Yeah. So who have you seen in here? Lots of, people. lots of people, lots and lots and lots. But um, recently, so obviously all the people that are at the Dunhill, um, but uh, Will Ferrell, obviously Ronan Keaton, he comes. Every, he's been coming a few yeah. years now. <laughs> he, he was, yeah, he's a funny one. Bill Murray's got great oh, stories. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 God, it's just hard to remember he's who's he's not been in. Yeah. And I've heard Jamie Dornan loves coming here. Yeah, yeah, yeah he likes yeah. his pint, doesn't he? Yeah, just standing at the bar having a drink, drink. with everybody else. Yeah. That's yeah. so yeah. fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what are some of the orders that you will get the most often? Guinness. Um, Guinness, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone Guinness. wants a Guinness <laughs> after Guinness. a long day on the course. Yeah. You have the wind blown. Yeah, Guinness. Guinness What's your favorite memory from over the years? So I, I think personally, it's like when they come back and they kind of recognize that, that, that you're here still and they kind of just go, hi Louise, how are you? How's the family? How are you doing? You know, I just think to me that kind of outweighs everything because it means that, you know, end of day people care. It? Yeah, it's been really tough recently, obviously, with hospitality and stuff, but this week just, you know, just brings it all back and makes it feel like it's just back to normal. Back to, yeah. And, yeah, a bit, bit norm normality. Yeah, within it's the, great. Love it. It's my favourite week out every, of every yeah. week in the, <laughs> out of the year. It's my favourite week. Really? Really, even before the Open this gives us our, like This gives us our adrenaline rush. So, yeah, and then the week comes and like, that's it. It's the whole week just on, working. Just because it's just so full on, all week, every day. The whole, and, the whole place is just a buzz. A normal year too. This place is so packed. Mm -hmm. It's just full of laughter. Yeah. But it's such a great atmosphere. Oh, totally. totally so there's yeah. a wee window at the side of the jigger, and there's been times where we haven't been able to go round, so we've had to serve through the window because <laughs> it's been so packed. <laughs> so busy, you just can't. Yeah, get you around. just have yeah. putting pints through the window or food through the window. Does anyone ever run off the 17th and sneak in for a quick pint? It was, there was somebody that really, really desperate needed the bathroom, and they ran in, ran upstairs, which was to the ladies' bathroom, not the gents, <laughs> up the stairs, went to the toilet, and ran back out again. I can't remember who that was. No, I can't. Somebody hit well, maybe the... I do remember it, but I'm not allowed to tell you. That's maybe what it is. Oh, that's maybe what it there is. There is a confidentiality <laughs> yes, about this absolutely. place that yeah. makes it so cool, because yeah. your guys' lips are sealed, right? Yeah. What goes on in the jigger stays in the jigger. <laughs> Cheers, ladies. Cheers. Cheers. Sip of the Jigger Ale. So fun catching up with Louise and Esther and learning more about this historic landmark right here on the old course.